loves thanks for returning i hope this video finds you happy and doing well as you know by the thumbnail this video is going to be on one of michael kors new bags by the name of everly so if you're interested then just keep watching all right so this is her this is she isn't she so adorable okay so i'm just gonna do a quick 360 right when you're going all the way around all right so I'm not gonna keep you all long I'm just gonna give you all a few dimensions and tell you all what fits in the bag all right so I'm just gonna go ahead and read the dimensions to you just so you know this is considered a satchel it's got the traditional logo print canvas uh, the width is 11 inches the height is 8.5 and the depth is 5 inches it's got a handle drop of 4 inches and it's also got a strap it's got an exterior details with front and back slit pockets it's got interior details which would include back zip pocket it's got two front slip pockets and it does have a snap fastening in the middle so what drew me to this bag is all of the compartments that it has and and the size. Um, I really love the traditional logo canvas print. I think it looks really nice. I do like the snap closure right here in the middle and I like that because that just kind of gives you easy access for your common items. And I really like how the front part right here, this pocket, goes from this end all the way to the other end. So you really can put um, quite a few things in there same goes when you flip it around you can stick you see how far it pretty much goes the length of the bag and my hand goes all the way in as you can see it also has a zipper compartment so and that again goes the length of the bag it goes stops to about right here and all the way to the top you see the zipper up there so you've got this compartment you have this and then on the front side, when you flip it back over, you have another pocket like you do with this zipper, except this one has a snap closure, and that one too goes the length of the bag. So if you carry a lot of things that have to be separated or you just like them to be separated, this would definitely be a bag to go for. On the inside, you get another zipper compartment okay and it almost goes the length of the bag probably to about here here to here okay so I could definitely fit my entire hand in there and then on the front part you have two slip pockets and it does come with a strap let me go ahead and strap it in so you can see And I do like the fact that it doesn't have the little chain added to it. It just kind of makes it more of a conservative type of bag and takes less of the dressy element out of it. And this is what it looks like. Um, it's a really nice size bag. It's somewhere in the middle. It's not too small and it's not too big. And I think that a lot of things can really fit in it. I'm going to show you what all can fit in it. And I'm also going to show you what it looks on my body frame. I'm 5'7 and I wear a size 14. So anyway, let's talk about what can fit in it. So the bag that I'm going to be transferring it from is this coach bag. Okay, and I forget the name. I'll put the name somewhere on the screen, but this is like my everyday, just no think about it bag. I do like the color green. It's not my favorite color, but I do like the color green. This is just my no think about it. So I have my wallet, okay, and I've got, what do I have in here? My, a little can of deodorant and like, uh, a hand moisturizer just things like that I have that I have my pencils and I'm gonna go ahead and put all of that in here so I've got all of that in as you can see it's still plenty of room all right and I have my coin purse and I have another coin purse so I'm gonna put this in the main compartment 
Well, you know what? I'm just gonna put those in the zip. So you see that? I got them here and then I got that in the main compartment. So I'm gonna go ahead and zip that up. So I have this little pouch and in this little pouch I have Kleenex and I have some hand sanitizer. And this is what it looks like. All right, and I have my little binder that I like to keep little notes in. I also have my little extra bag right here. And I also have my mirror. So I'm gonna put my mirror in the front slot pocket. I'm gonna put this little binder thing in the front. No, no, no. I'm gonna put that in the main compartment. And I'm gonna put this in the main compartment. There you go, see? And then I have my mirror in this little part. And lastly, just for quick access, I'm gonna put this in the front main compartment, which would be right here. I have my phone right there. I'm not sure if you can see it right there. So I'm gonna snap it all up. All right, so now that I have everything in it, this is how it looks. Okay, the silhouette is really nice and smooth. It doesn't look lumpy or bumpy. Now, could more have fit in here? Definitely, yes, but I don't like it when uh, the shape of the purse begins to be a little bit distorted. And this is it. And so you can still see some of it kind of peeping at the top, but I feel like all of my valuables and stuff, like my main wallet is at the bottom, and then I have my other uh, money in the zipper part. So, yeah. So I'm going to show you how it looks on my body frame and that's it. Let me know what you think about the Everly. Have you seen it around? Have you seen it in Macy's or have you seen it at any of the Michael Kors stores? Let me know what you think about it down in the comments. I'd love to hear about it. Thank you so much for tuning in and until my next video, smooches.